Okay, so have you heard about this movie, Enora? Hmm. It's got a really uh, interesting premise. Yeah. And we thought we'd uh, take a deep dive into it today. Yeah, this is going to be a fun one. It's like a modern Cinderella story. Oh, okay. But instead of glass slippers and a fairy godmother, right. we've got uh, the backdrop of Brooklyn and uh, the world of Russian oligarchs. Oh, wow. So you can already see where this is going. I like it already. Yeah. yeah. And it kind of taps into that whole fascination we have these days with stories about different cultures clashing, you know? Oh, for sure. What is it about those kinds of stories that grab us right now? What's well, a good question? And it may be something our listeners can think about as we go through this. Yeah. But first, let's get into some of the basics of the movie. Okay. So uh, the title is Honora. Pretty straightforward. Yeah. And it's a comedy drama. Okay. I like that. So we can probably expect a little bit of everything. Yeah, a mix of laughs and tears. Exactly. It's intriguing. And it's set to premiere in France on October 30th. Oh, wow. So just a couple of days away from when we're recording this. Yeah. Perfect timing for everyone to get all the info they need before deciding whether to check it out. Absolutely. And it's a bit of a longer movie. Clocks in at two hours and 19 minutes. Okay. So settle in for this one. You'll need some popcorn for this one for sure. Yeah. Now the plot. Okay. This is where things get really interesting. Lay it on me. It centers on a Brooklyn stripper named Honora. Okay. And she ends up marrying the son of a Russian oligarch. Whoa. Talk about a whirlwind. Everybody. That's quite the culture clash. Total clash of worlds. Yeah. And as you can imagine, this leads to all sorts of family drama. I can only imagine what the in-laws are like. Right. And there are even talks of a potential marriage in Alma. Oh, wow. So things get messy. Oh, yeah. It seems like there's so much potential for social commentary in this story, you know? Absolutely. You've got the clash of wealth and values, and then you have the expectations placed on women in both these very different worlds. It's a lot to unpack. It really is. Yeah. And, you know, the film is directed by Sean Baker. Oh, interesting. And he's known for his pretty gritty realist filmmaking style. Mm -hmm. Often using non-professional actors and shooting on location. Oh, wow. So like a really authentic feel. Exactly. Interesting. So his choice to direct this movie with its blend of humor and social critique, I think is really interesting. It definitely suggests he might be bringing that signature raw style to the story. Yeah, I'd say so. Cool. The film stars Mikey Madison. Okay. You might recognize her from some of her previous roles. Uh-huh. And she's joined by Mark Eidelstein and Yura Borisov. Okay. Some new faces, maybe. Yeah, could be a breakout role for them. That's always exciting. And actually, there's an interview with Mikey Madison going around that I think would be worth checking out. Oh, cool. Yeah, those kinds of interviews can be really insightful. Yeah, she talks about her character and some of the themes the film explores. It's always fascinating to hear how actors connect with their roles. For sure. Yeah. So there you have it. That's everything you need to know about Honora. Sounds like a movie worth watching. Definitely one to add to your list. Absolutely. Now, as you're thinking about this film, here's something I think would be interesting to consider. Okay. How do you think they're going to portray Honora navigating both the world of stripping and the world of extreme wealth? That's a great question. You know, are there going to be some unexpected parallels between the two? Oh, that's a good point. Particularly when it comes to power dynamics and how society views these women. I'm really curious to see how they handle that. Yeah, it's sure to be thought-provoking. Definitely something to think about. So thanks for joining us for this deep dive into Honora. It was a pleasure. We're excited to see how this movie unfolds. Me too. All right, until next time. Bye. See ya. See ya.